Welcome to Grayon Mat. We have a triangle and inside this triangle is subdivided into three parts. And this green triangle inside the largest triangle is has one side which is parallel to the side of the largest square and that side is actually B parallel to the segment A. And one part of this triangle is in blue and it measures 10 square units and we are required to find the area of the green region okay so first thing that we have to do is we notice that this triangle i mean this smaller triangle this one is actually proportional to this larger triangle okay it is because they have this this same angle this same angle and these two sides are actually parallel and these two sides are actually proportional to each other so this length is the longer side and it is for the larger triangle and this length is actually the corresponding length for the smaller triangle and for this side at the bottom this five unit length of the green triangle is for the smaller and this is the 5 plus 2 is for the larger and since the lengths are proportional and in between them is an angle that is congruent to those two triangles then by SAS similarity or similarity theorem these two triangles are actually similar because we have two pairs of sides that are similar or proportional to each other and in between those sides is an angle that is congruent to both of them okay so since these two triangles are actually similar we can actually label this this length as x and this length as y y next is we make an equation about their proportionality so we focus on the green triangle we have the y over 5 is equal to next is we focus on the largest triangle and that is x plus y over 2 plus 5 or y over 5 is equal to x plus y over 7 so we have 7 y is equal to 5 x plus 5y so we have 7y minus 5y is equal to 5x so continuing we have 2y is equal to 5x or simplifying we can say that y if we divide both sides by 2 y is equal to 5 halves of x okay so next is we use the fact that y is equal to 5 halves x so it is equal to 5 halves of x okay so next if we, is we focus on this combination of this blue and the green triangle so we draw a line from this point and this line should be perpendicular 
to the side and we call this length as the height the common height of these two triangles the green and the blue so let us call that as h okay so next is we call this area of the green to be m okay so next step is we write uh, two equations for this area of these two triangles so we have m is equal to one half times the base for the green is actually five halves x and the height is it actually h we re re represented it as h and for the blue we have 10 is equal to one half times the base which is x and the height which is h and we label this respectively as equation one and equation two okay so next is we divide equation number one by equation two so it is equal to m over 10 is equal to we cancel this one half and one half and this x and this h and h is equal to five halves so if we cross multiply we have m is equal to five times ten all over two which give us us 25 and since m is the area so area is equal to 25 square units for the green and that is our answer so thank you for watching until the end of the video please like the video if you like our solution and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so you will be updated for more math videos like this thank you bye